loading screen. Uh, real quick before I start, I wanted to uh, tell you guys that I have a Patreon page. Uh, you guys will see a link in the description. Uh, it'll be like right above all of my other links. It'll be the very first one that I post. Um, I didn't make it for funding. I made it so I could get some of my written works out. Uh, I don't know how well it'll work. I don't know if it'll work, but we'll see. I'll also post this video up on the Patreon page just to kind of help uh, get the word out a little bit more and all of that. So check it out. Let me know what you guys think. Ideas, opinions, well, more so opinions than ideas are really useful and helpful. So we have just wrapped up a great deal of things, including the children of Adam, which we need to go talk to. And for anyone wondering, I do have a short story up on the Patreon page already. Uh, it'll probably be where I load up all of my short stories. As far as my larger works, if most likely I won't be posting those up you. there. But it's definitely one of those things I'll have to keep playing by here. In the throes of a brilliant vision, he spoke, and now I obey. Atom demands peace. With Farhara, with Acadia, within our family. And any found disobeying Atom's word will answer for their crimes. Let none stand in the way of his radiant will. Glory to Atom! I confess, sir. You. I knew it. I knew it was you. In my vision. There, beside our brilliant master. Here, you must have this. It. It only seems right it's worn by his favored child. It guys, we've done it. No more Far Harbor, no more Arcadia, no more Children of Adam. So, there are still a few side missions that I have left to accomplish around here. Uh, do, do, do. So we need to talk to Kasumi, which we'll do that in a moment. Okay. So I definitely want to deal with that. This one, however, is the one that I'm... I'm not going to say the most interested in, but... Of 
of course, this time there's no loading screen. Well, there is a loading screen, it's just not the, the regular loading screen. The one that I always cut out. Anyway, while I wait, yeah, the uh, Patreon page, like I said, I'm not doing it for... I'm doing it more so for... Um, the wrong dog on place. Oh well, since we're already here. Uh, I'm doing it more so for, uh, just to kind of, as a place where I can post some of my, uh, so, you've talked to Dima. You know why we're here. Most of my I certainly hope that works. you'll consider helping us. Dima's vision is worth fighting for. You're right. It is a good cause. Since definitely deserve to be safe, just like everyone else. It's so good to hear that. Very encouraging. Please, make sure Demon knows that as well. He's put so much of himself into this. All his time and energy devoted to helping others. He never stops to think of himself. Sometimes I worry about... Well, if I wasn't here to make sure his equipment is all functional. And that's not even mentioning maintaining the fog condensers. So many things to keep track of. You do all this work yourself? Mostly, yes. I get help from the others when I can. But no one else really understands Dima the way I do. Can you tell me about the fog condensers? Oh, those? Dima and I designed them when it became clear the fog was only getting worse. They're effective, but have such a limited range. Dima insisted we provide them to the people of Far Harbor, and I'm so glad we did. Without the condensers, I'm not sure they'd have anywhere left. Dima looks like he's had a lot of work done. Well, that's certainly an understatement. Between the two of us, we've made so many modifications. He was just a prototype, never built for all this. It took a lot to overcome the limitations of the original design and expand his memory. It really is remarkable, isn't it? He's overcome so much. He's become so much more than he once was. And all he thinks of is others. If there's anything I can do to help out, just let me know. Well, if you're determined to help, there is something you could do. It's likely somewhat dangerous, though, so I understand if you'd rather not. There's a boat along the coast of the island. It was transporting some hardware we needed. Storage drives. The boat never finished the trip, you see. So the drives are still out there. I could really use them here for extra parts, if nothing else. My understanding is that the boat wrecked southwest of here. So, does this sound like something you could handle? What happened to the boat? Why didn't it make it? I'm not entirely sure, to be honest. Trappers, fog crawlers... There's no end to what's out there, and what might still be out there. But the point is that we already lost someone once, and I don't want to see that happen again. <laughs> so, are you up for it? Sure thing, Faraday. I'll get the drives for you. And thank you. I really do appreciate it. It's not the the page isn't for trying to solicit money or anything like that. It's just trying to get. I wanted a place where I can post my smaller works and where people could have easier access to them, rather than me getting a whole bunch of people's email addresses and trying to email stuff to them back and forth. And Because this hotel is not clear. Oh, that's cleared. Yeah, a little, little flash travel.
amazing how much stuff there is underneath the water in this game. Something tells me this should have been a lot farther than this. those storage drives you asked for. Oh, that's great. Thank you. Uh, just the two? Really? I somehow thought there were three. What do you know? I did notice a locked chest that I couldn't open. Maybe the last one was in there. Do you have the key? Key? Chest? I'm afraid I don't know. I, uh, you know what? This is fine. Just these two is fine. Well, you did your part, so I'll do mine. Thank you for recovering these. Anyone else find that kind of strange? Yes? Nothing, just don't mind me. I'm looking around for anything that might say Victoria's key on it. <clears throat> yes? Tell me about yourself, Faraday. Me? I don't know why you care. I escaped the Institute, just like others here. Never had my mind wiped, thankfully. I like to think I came along right when Demon needed me. I found him before all this, before Acadia. He needed my help, though he refused to admit it. He's always been stubborn like that. Anyway, I've been by his side ever since, making sure he has everything he needs. Hmm. Sorry. Never mind. Okay. Interesting, interesting. So since we're here, let's go ahead and talk to the reason why we're here. Down one more. Oh, 
I'll send you saw some of the stuff. Kasumi. So, it sounds like there's going to be peace on the island. It was you, wasn't it? You found a way to fix things. You've been alright while I've been gone? Yeah, I have. I feel like a lot of weight has been lifted from my head. Hey, listen. So, when you first showed up, you came to get me. To bring me home. I've been thinking a lot about that. I hurt Kenji and Ray by leaving, didn't I? I could have just stayed home, pretended everything was alright, but I left them. Should I go back? They obviously still care about me. Or who they think I am. They need a daughter. They deserve to have one. Everything in Acadia has been settled. I found my answers. Maybe it's time I did something for someone else. What are you talking about? I know the real Kasumi is dead. She was replaced with me, but do Kenji and Ray really need to know that? What if we could be a family again? All I have to do is go home. Give them the daughter they thought they lost. Don't I owe them that? You're right, Kazumi. They need you. Go home. I will. I'll start gathering my supplies and I'll have to say goodbye to everyone. Thanks. For everything. Maybe I'll see you back in the Commonwealth? Oh, you can pretty much guarantee it. Because now I gotta go talk to your dad. <sighs> also, you're not a synth. I still don't think she's a synth. I know there's no real way to tell whether she's a synth or not, and honestly, in the end of the day, it doesn't matter. But it's just like, seriously. So I need to go to... Just make like two short videos to basically just do one 40 minute recording.
So we're at 93 now. Like, that's it, just I can track her using my Pip Boy radio. Yeah, that's really helpful, and thanks. I never could understand the purpose of this view. I think there's just supposed to be rocks and hills and things. Okay, so we're at 98.2%. Which means that thing should literally be around here somewhere. I mean, like, I should be able to see it. again. So whenever it takes a while to pop up, it stays the same. Okay. Nothing's more satisfying than a smoking gun and a pocket full of cats. There's gotta be like a cave or something in this area that I'm not seeing. So forgive me for a moment while I go scouring around this area looking for a cave. Yeah, I'm, I'm not worried about the timer, the, the ticker thing anymore. Because it's in this area.
this was a case of me having to kill the anglers in the area. So I think maybe inside one of the buildings. Only thing better than get a so like maybe in one of the buildings there's a, a secret passage or something. Just a case of you have to get this thing to 100%, which, frankly, I do not see how you're going to be able to do. Next person that asks me to shag is getting a well placed kick. If you get money in it, why bother? Oh, That's just protect. garbage. I toss it. Let's try this without our weapon out. What I wouldn't give for a good stiff drink. Okay. Nothing's more satisfying than a smoking gun. I mean, DC, I mean, it's just how much it changes. Look, 99.1. Sixty-six again. Only sixty-two. Three. Ninety-three. Nope. Like, I'm telling you guys, it's gotta be. It's either something underground or something above ground or something in the trees, and there's no room in the trees. That light is Nick, by the way. Legit, like 99.90. Like, even 99% should be enough to. Five, 
too. Maybe. Seriously, seventy three, seventy six, seventy nine, five, still eighty five, eighty one. Alright, so what I'm going to most likely do is I'm going to look up how to find this stupid thing. Most likely it's some sort of bug or glitch that's happening with my game and uh, is not relevant to anyone else's game. So either A, no one's ever had this happen before, or B, most people just be like, oh, well, it's easy. You just do this and problem solved. You have a good save? I know I did. I was hoping maybe if I like slept for a little bit, something would change. Like maybe it'd be roaming around. <sighs> all right. Well, I've done all I can do, man. I can do. I'm going to keep searching for this thing. Especially because it's chewing into my time. So, do, do, do we still need to talk to Sturges? Oh, wow. We still haven't even finished that. And when you go take care of this, which is going to drop us off out there anyway, uh, I'll come back and deal with that later.